the game where you can actually play with your food. O'Reilly Grant helped create a new board game. Yeah, it combines charcuterie and competition. We love right. charcuterie around here, and don't we? And we like a little competition, too. <laughs> oh, man, alive. We always win in competitions. So we sent Melissa Stevens to Old Mama's in South Bend to check it out for us. What is your ideal weather? 75 and sunny. Perfect. <laughs> if it could be like that all the time, I would love it. Conversation and delicious food. It's what the board game Nosh is all about. It's something that we had never heard anyone doing before of actually playing with your food in this way. Riley High School grad Kelly Norman and her friend decided to create a game that could bring people and food together. And we have the cards, which are conversation cards, and they have prompts on them just to kind of spark conversation and let you get to know people. It all starts with building the board and placing your own charcuterie pieces on there. You as the host can choose to choose all of those um, pieces or you can tell your friends that you're playing with, hey, bring your favorite snack item and then you can have a super eclectic fun mix. Now I'm a big board game lover and obviously I love food. So I decided to bring along some friends from WNDU to try it out for ourselves. We can each pick a color, I'll take red. And so you're going to roll and then you're going to just pick any place on the outside ring to start. Each player works their way around the board, reading conversation cards and eating items off the board. Where do you go first when you enter a convenience store? Ooh. I think it's like a tie between candy and like soda pop. Mm -hmm. Because you have to know what, what you're drinking to go with the candy, you know, yeah. but sometimes the candy leads, it, yeah. leads what you're doing. Okay, the ultimate go. goal? to reach the center. Read the card first. Oh, no, wait a minute. Wait, I don't like this one. <laughs> it says, move back a ring. Don't bother sliding down a spoon if you are in the outer ring. Oh, Skip oh. turn. You're only, it's just, what does just this it. mean? Norman is excited to see her vision come to life, but she can't do it without the community's help. In order to fund the first launch of Nosh, I need a little bit of, of funding, of seed, seed money for it. So I'm running a Kickstarter. You can pledge a certain amount of, uh, of money to the campaign. Our goal is $15,000. How would it feel to see your game in a store? <laughs> oh my god, that would be amazing. So I can oh. just jump the deck and I'm in creamy land. I only got two more layers to get into to the winner. <laughs> Oh, I love that. That's really cool. That's a genius. I love it. Yeah, food brings people together, Indeed. that's mm -hmm. for sure. Norman, by the way, has until October 9th to raise $15,000. If you're interested in pitching in, we'll have a link on our website, WNDU.com. I love food, so I'm all in. Me too. Let's go. Still ahead. <laughs>